Hey Insane, hey Brummy, hey Andrea. Brummy, you cannot wait for this. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I couldn't wait for uh I couldn't wait for the stream either. Uh it's been the last time I streamed was January, so it's been a three months. Oh no, like two and a half. We Costa. Happy Saturday. Happy Saturday, uh broker. Hello. What's up guys? Doing well? Remember the last one? Oh yeah, like the New Year's stream with a little bit of Real Amiga and... Uh, what else did I do on last stream? Basically just playing a little bit, right? But today... Today we got something new. Today we got the release of SWAS 2024.0. So over the last two, two and a half months, or like more like three or four months, we've been... Passing around ideas, uh, me and Starvins, on how to like spice things up. What could we add? What what's doable? What's like? You know, when we say doable, it's more like this is still a hobby. Novi, hi, what's up? So we always have to consider our own time with work and life, and but step by step, it's always something something new to the table. And today is quite a nice addition to SWAS twenty twenty. Um, I have I had to change my mic settings here a little bit, so please give me a heads up on how my sound is working. If you can hear me well, and if you can hear the background music. In the meantime, I have I have uh, checked out the supermarkets around here for some new ideas for beers. Yes, beers is always an, a vital part if you play Swas. Um, so I found I found one that is quite like suitable. From the name you know swas is obviously the greatest of all time games um thank you Rui costa for the feedback uh thanks brummy it's called the golden goat look at this it's from sam adams and it says crisp and easy just like swas so i'm gonna pour myself a beer before uh, before I go into any like gameplay presentations, because it's Saturday, it's weekend, and I hope you guys can enjoy one too. 1984 EFC, thank you. Nice. And welcome to the stream, welcome in. Hmm. That's good, it has a nice color. Cheers. Okay, so what's going on today with SWAS 2020 4.0? We have added two new gameplay modes. So finally, you know, Amiga, the original Amiga SWAS is running on 50 frames per second, which is great on the original machine. On emulation, it's okay too. But somehow with SWAS 2020, uh, it didn't look quite right on like big flat screens. So I was like always eager, hey, can we can we get 60 frames per second gameplay? So um, we've played around with uh, tweaking the gameplay here and there, trying to get it to 60 frames per second. Wasn't easy. It was running on 50 frames per second, but then all the gameplay physics were off. So when I say Amiga 60 frames per second, it is probably 98 or 99 percent of Amiga gameplay. There might be some slight minimal differences in gameplay. The same goes for the Xbox Live Arcade gameplay. So the Xbox Live Arcade gameplay is basically Amiga, but with a DOS Keeper. So that should be very spot on. Um, before I go into that, let's see what else is new. Uh, Insane, I haven't forgotten about you. I think you've been working a lot on your uh, DLC releases. So um, here, the last one that you did was this one. Oh, thank you for the follow, Noah, Noah from Cork. Is that Cork from Cork is in Northern Ireland or an island? Sorry if I mixed that up. <laughs> so uh, insane! Thank you for your latest edition. You uh, created some NBA teams here. 
the NBA 75. Um, so now you can play with uh, NBA teams in SWAS. It's pretty cool. And a nice background theme too. Looks cool. So if you're a basketball fan and you like SWAS, uh, this might be something funny for you to try. <laughs> Very cool. Um, I think other than that, it's just like SWAS 2020. Um, oh, and of course, if you are interested to join the Sensible Days in Summer, the SWAS World Cup, it's taking place in Barcelona. So, if you are interested, check out this. I'm gonna post the link in the chat. Here's the tournament on Facebook, and here is also the tournament on our website, forum. So you get all the information here if you are interested to join Sensible Days this summer in Barcelona and play the Swas World Cup. Um, okay. I want you to look at one thing before I boot up Swas to show you the new features. And that is this. So what you see here, right here, is the old DOS menu. That is the old, like, original menu of the DOS version of SWAS. Right next to it, on the right side, you see the original Amiga SWAS menu. Looked like that. And then here on the bottom, this is kind of a merge of these together. This is the Xbox version of SWAS. So these are the three original versions that were available, that are available to buy. DOS. Amiga and Xbox. And Xbox basically is a mix of the Amiga menu buttons and the PC DOS background. And as you can see, those menus are pretty clustered. It was okay, but since we've added new stuff, I felt like it's getting a little, a little too crowded here. Um, so I came up with the idea, how can we make this look a little like slicker for everybody to enjoy looking at it and giving it a little bit of an Amiga touch, but still like be close to the original feel. So I made concept arts constantly. Hazemaker, subscribed for five months in a row. Hazemaker, thank you for this up and welcome in. And thank you for the grads on the release. It's not out yet. Let me first present it and then I'm going to upload it to the server so everybody can update their launchers and enjoy it. So yeah, uh, we thought make the menu, menu buttons a little bigger and resort everything. So when you boot up nowadays retro soccer games, anything on your mobile device or any other game, the first menu button that you're getting onto is like a compute button. So we felt like, okay, we got the compete menu right here. And in there you find the, um, thank you. And in there you'll find like the regular stuff like career mode, do it yourself preset. And yeah, I think those, those three. And then there's a practice button, which holds friendly training, penalty shootouts and so on. Replays, which has a new menu, SWAS galore, getting into more details here in a moment. Then we have the options rearranged over here, editing, some extras, and then we have new buttons for loading and saving. Because if you look at the old ones, it was kind of like, okay, these long ones are not really needed, It's and it doesn't have a nice icon, so put a little disk on here to save and to load, and then the continue button right here where it was. I think that was good. All right, shall we check out how that looks in the game? Why not? Mm. Sai, welcome. Sai42, welcome to the chat. Um, welcome to the stream. Yeah, thank you. I think it looks very sharp. Okay, gameplay. Let's start up the game. Oh, yeah, and as you can see here in the launcher, Xbox, Amiga 60 frames per second, 
And then the original Amiga was 50 frames per second and the original DOS was 70 frames per second. So these two are not ideal for modern monitors because they always run on like 60 frames per second or a multiply of that, like 120, 240. So I'm going to go with Amiga 60 frames per second. Start the game. And here we go. New menu, live, alive, and kicking. Um, let me adjust the chat. It's a little, little blocky over there. Ricosta or something, it could be nice. Amiga 500 Mini, if you save state, it will create a label for the floppy disk. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's nice. <laughs> Okay, uh, boop, where's my chat box? There we go. That's better. Yep, so welcome to the new menu. And the first thing that you might notice, hey, it has the buttons that look like in the Amiga versions. So, but if I push my finger on the F5 button, look what happens. Tuck. And F5 again. So now you can even switch between your favorite versions of Swast, which is DOS right here. These are the colors of the original DOS release. And with F5 you can go back to the Amiga colors. And the slightly 3D buttons from Amiga. Fernando... Fernando Kun... Roger. Hey. Regards, regards to Brazil! Thank you, CKF. Thank you for the follow. <laughs> um, and here, we have added another little button. In case somebody doesn't like realize you can do it with F5, you can just click on it and it goes to the old DOS, to the old DOS um, menu colors. But really, I love the Amiga buttons, and it's like super accurate, like super accurate. You look in the, um, just look how the this looks, and if you compare that to WinUI, it's like spot on uh, Amiga. And I think I somewhere have a comparison, like a live comparison thing between the two of them. We just scroll up in our like concept arts and development chats. Um, Starbins has put them aside to, next to each other. I'll be right there. Come on, where is it? Oh yeah, here we go. Mm. Discord. Here, if you look at that, you see on the left side is original Amiga played in an emulator, the menus, and on the right side is the recreated Amiga menu look and colors on SWAS 2020. I think this is as spot on as you can get, even with slight, slight adjustments here um, at the top. And we have also changed the light blue color just a little bit so you can see the uh, text a little better. Okay. Well, let's go back in the game. Is there a plan to create a WHD version of those databases? Um, like 90, 91, 91, 92. Uh, I mean, basically you can create I don't have any plans to do that right now, a recoster, but you can do that yourself if you just um, download. There is a, a SWAS HDF file for both of them, 9091 and 9192. Those came from an Amiga release. So you can copy and paste the data, data folder and the SWAS2 file into your, into your WHD load um, directory. But yeah. So I hope you really like the way it looks now. Uh, what else is new? Okay, compete. Sure, you get this menu here. 
you have the career mode, you have do-it-yourself competitions and preset as, as usual and the speedrun mode is in here right now. Um, there you go. And then we have replays and we've added the button replay controls. If you look at that, it gives you a whole like bunch of information on how to control replays, highlight files or match replays. Mm. And it says like how to speed up a replay, how to go in slow-mo, how to re rewind forward, how to stop the replay. Basically, yeah, everything. Director mode, that's right. Exactly, Brummy. <laughs> All right, Swas Galore, I'm going to show you in a moment. Um, what else did we add? Okay, those buttons down here, you can see. Oh, um... We have added a hotkey because let's say you are looking at your squad or you're like you're looking at at your next game and you feel like oh I forgot about saving my career. I really need to save. And you're like a little lazy and you don't want to go back all the way with exit and exit and exit. All you have to do now is press F6 point and it brings you directly into the save menu. Okay, so with F6 you have a hotkey for saving. And then it throws you back into your menu. Um, so since this is Amiga 60 frames per second, let me play one match. I just started a random career with Inter Milan in the uh, database of 1990-91. Yeah, so with F6 you can call the save menu from anywhere. And this is how Swas looks with 60 frames per second. I should have, yeah, on the top, on the top left you see the F frames per second counter, it goes up to 60, it's like super smooth. There we go. That is magnificent. I'm American, so Inter just makes me think of Inter Miami. Oh, <laughs> well, you're American. Where, um, where do you live? I'm in I'm in San Diego, but I'm German. <laughs> Looking for some open space. He's free. You see, it plays just like it should look like spot on Amiga Swas, but it's way smoother. Yeah, I saw Bayern four nothing. That's why I could like stream with. Oh, nice save. That's a cleanly won header. Headed on. And that's a good header. Gonna play this one match and then I. Um, I changed to the Xbox gameplay so you can see that as well. Southeast US, Atlanta. Braves. Hey, I'm a Dodger. We just got Freddie Friedman. Not a bad move. There we go. How did you, uh, how, how do you know Swas when you're from the US? Like what's, what's your connection with the game? Worth a try. Oh, what a try. Exchange of passes, finding their men well. Yeah, I bet you're not that happy, but hey, well, uh, congrats again on your World Series title. That's a cleanly one header. And that's a good header. Good through ball up the middle. He's oh, oh! That shot was on target and the post saved him. Neat ball through the middle. He lets fly and scores! Amiga Magazine billboard? <laughs> Maybe. Should be. It's a good passing move. Good through ball up the middle. Mm hmm. I started getting into soccer. 
and soccer games, I like the combination of them. Yes, it is. So, did you play it first on, on an Amiga, or um, did you play the uh, DOS version? With his head! Strong, punched away! With his head! Oh, Ooh. Hit that one well enough. Not a bad effort, though. And a strong header. That's a cleanly won header. And that's a very fine header. So it really plays super nice with 60 frames per second. And all the classic goals, as you can see, all those classic goals uh, work here. So this is basically what I was doing when we were like amping up Swas to. 60 frames per second, I tried all those old sweet spots and s and checked if the ball was going into the net where it's supposed to be. And when it wasn't, I had to tweak ball physics, basically. Well, player physics. That goal is... No, that goal is an Amiga goal. It works on DOS not as regularly as on Amiga. That little passage of play was beautiful. Unlucky goalkeeper! And a really well taken goal! Yeah, there is a Genesis CD vote. Yeah, uh, no, it's not Swas on the Genesis. It's like a Sensible Soccer. Um, Sensible Soccer 1.2. And Master System, yeah. Master System is pretty lousy. To be honest, I think Master System is... One of the worst Sensible Soccer versions out there. And that's a good header. Well won in the air. Well, perhaps they're going to wait just a little bit longer to see that guy is injured. He does seem to be in pain now, though. Let's see how bad he's injured. Okay. Well, it's okay. And a header! Headed on. Well Get in there. Good touch of the ball for the goalkeeper. Well, he really seems to be struggling now. Surely the uh -oh. manager is going to make a change. I don't know if you can get much closer than that. Poor guy. <laughs> well, will we see a bit of a reshuffle in attack in this move? He's been brought on to change things round up front, that's for sure. Great ball through. Ooh. It's on his head. head. It's was that a foul? No, no, says the referee, and waves him back to his feet. Yeah. Okay, let me save. Um, and show you the Xbox gameplay. A win is a win is a win. That's right. And Swas is near impossible scoring like that, and it was near shocking for me. Okay. Yeah. Um. So on Amiga, that's true, but the DOS version, you can, you can score with straight shots. So, let me just pull up the. Uh, save, I'm gonna save this. Okay. Jump out of the game. And now I'm gonna do the 60 frames per second Xbox Live, Xbox Live account gameplay. Back in here. And practice. I'm gonna do training because there's something that Uh, I wanted to show you too. Here are three new features for training. So now you can enable the defense, the midfield, or the attack, or combine them. So if you have everything off, you just play against the goalkeeper. That's perfect for, um, for training. Let me put the goalie skill on pro. And, well, for the fun of it, just enable the mid. Oh no, no, just off. Off for now. So I can show you the Xbox Live card, like DOS goalkeeper, where you can just score straight next to the post. Uh, poop. Club teams. Okay. This is 1991, so... Where am I going with? How about national teams? National teams. That's good. National teams. Germany. And poop, that's it. Okay, I got Feller and Klinsmann. That's pretty good here. 
and I go into training. And as you can see, there is a radar. So we enable the radar too for the training mode. Saved. <laughs> the goalkeeper shouldn't leave his goal here. You see, you just shoot straight and it's in. You can even uh, shoot from a little further outside. Should go in too. Oops, post. Okay, now he saved it. But yeah. Um, Boom. Can you see that? So that goal is just possible with a DOS goalkeeper. There you go. It's going straight and straight into the goal. Um, we had a radar. Oh, I think we tried radar in, in one of the earlier versions, but it just didn't make much sense. So if you play against, if you play against a, a computer team like in career mode, radar really doesn't make sense because the game is too fast. You have no time to look on that radar. But here in training. It's kind of interesting. Let me activate just the midfield of my opponent uh, of my opponent. And then I click random team. Okay, it gives me these guys. The randomizer is sometimes funny. What kind of teams you come up with here? Venezuela. Yara Kuyanos FC. Yes, correct. The radar looks like kickoff. A little bit like kickoff, but it's different. So now you see on the radar. There's just those four midfielders there. So you can practice how it is to keep the ball with only a midfield in opposition. Before they catch up on you, try to score a goal. My players uh, that I randomly been assigned to a lousy. <laughs> but it's cool. So it's a nice feature to train with. Yeah. Or you can say, hey, I want to practice against a defense. A defense role. Choose your teams and let's say take Germany again and I want to practice against um oops oh yeah um a good team of defenders Sci42 thanks for checking in thank you you can download it later like in about in about an hour I'm gonna I'm gonna release so now you see on the radar, there's just the defense. You can see how you do against custom defenders there. You don't have to worry that they will score. the ball back into this automatically but yeah it's, it's very good for training all right so far for the training mode let me say i want to practice my defense when the attack on and always try to block their shots 
You only have a Mac? Uh, yes, there is there is an easy way to play Swass on a Mac. Um, if you are a little bit like savvy with computers, uh, let me just give you a link, uh, DM Denmark. So you would head to our forum and there is a tutorial on how to get Swass 2020 to run on a Mac. Tutorial Mac OS X. And it has all the steps in there. So here's your link so you can check this out how it works on a Mac. All right, what else is new? Um, oh yeah, Swas Galore. So we were thinking like, since you can compete in speedruns now and upload your speedruns, and there's basically a, a chart of, of, of speedruns here, and you can check out your time. Uh, let me just check one. Bobby Burkbass, 10 golds, amateur Amiga. He just hit the number one spot. Under three minutes, Bobby Bobras, pretty impressive. Uh, and you are able to watch these things live. Brahmi, thank you. Yeah, training is really great now. It's really awesome. So let's check out Bobby Bobras' uh, run of 10 goals. Mm -hmm. If it doesn't look that smooth, that's because Bobby Bobras was still on 50 frames per second. Yeah, DM Denmark, uh, no problem. If you need help with anything concerning the Mac, just let me know. Uh, and don't forget your replay. You can always go back, forth, back, forth, or speed it up. Oop. <laughs> Renal One Five Nice run Bobby Wobras Six <laughs> Seven Eight Nine. And. Ooh, he could have even squeezed out a few more seconds there if he hadn't, if he hadn't missed that shot. <laughs> there you go. Ten goals in two minutes and 56 seconds. And as you saw, he had some misses in there, so you can even better this time. Nice run, Bobby. So yeah, the speedrun mode introduced last year. How many runs? Oh, we have a total runs of 1,977 by now. So it's pretty, people really like to play this mode. Okay, so Swas Galore. You might have wondered, hey, I have this replay file. How can I share this? I have, I've scored such a nice goal. I want to show that to people. We were thinking, if we have replay files, if we have speedrun mode in the game and people can watch that, they should just be able to share their highlights in the game too. So we thought of a name and I was like, well, if they share not just goals, but anything concerning SWAS, which is awesome, this has to be SWAS galore. It's gold safe tackles and more, so this is SWAS galore. <laughs> and it even rhymes. So how does it work? Paul Samuel Higgins, uh, what's up? Um, welcome in. I remember you, I think, is it Higgy Poker? There were a few guys with the name of Higgins or Higgy. Um, anyways, so Swas Galore, if you want to share your highlights, uh, let's say you've recorded a highlight after a match, the old regular menu, right? Awesome. Higgy Poker. Uh, thank you for the sub. Thank you for the sub. Uh, Chikio CKF. You did the funky web editor. That was right. 
um, and you want to share one of those highlights, you go to Swas Galore, you log in with your username, you go to share highlights and you see this menu and you will find your highlight file. You can even add a note to it, random note, so people know, hey, what should I look for in this highlight? So for example, I've been sharing this this shot here, bandshot.highl, uh, highlight, and I thought, hey, how can I name, give that a note, bending shot outwards, so you would go and share, you would click on share to make it on, so this is a toggle. And then you can also select the scene. What's a scene? So well, let's say, let's say, let me do this live, why not? Let me demonstrate. Now practice. Okay, club teams. All right. I'm Munich against Herder Berlin with the squats from 1990, just because I love them. Okay, then you play a game. Uniform selector is pretty much known by now. And I'm going to score three, three goals. And then... Oh, good work to get possession. Hit the post! Okay. I'm going to save that by pressing space. It was a nice situation. You can always use the space bar. Hmm? He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. He makes the stop. Corner then. With his head, now he shoots and he's there we go. Scored. So there's a goal after the corner. They've got the ball. That's a cleanly won header. He'll shoot and he will score. Okay, so these three things. Let's say my match is over. I think I can press escape. Go exit. And I can save those highlights. As usual, you go to highlights. Save them. Give the name. Let's say... um, Corner header. Because that's the goal I wanted to share. Corner header. Save the highlights. Then I can view the highlights too. And you see on the on the on the overlay down there that I've got three scenes. My game uh, my gamepad is probably covering it, but I think it's that scene. Yeah, it's the corner, so it's scene number two of that highlight file. This is the one I wanted to show people. So the second scene from three. Alright, here's the third one. So it can go out. I know aha, it's my second one. My second scene, I go to Swas Galore, I log in, share highlights, and then corner header right here. Classic header after oh no. Tuck, enter, and then I'm gonna select scene number two right here. You can toggle that with your gamepad. You can share all of them, or just select the one that you want to share. And then I click on. That's it. That's all you have to do. And if you wonder how is it shared now, yes, after you click exit on this menu, it's been uploaded. So you can do whatever you want to do in here. Uh, nothing happens before you press exit. Then when I press exit, have your eye on this spot of the screen down here. The updating server data, uploading highlight file. And there we go. Okay, and now other people can rate it. You would go to rate highlights if you want to rate other people's highlights. If you try to rate your own highlight, you might get prompted. This is not a self-assessment. Let somebody else rate your highlight. So you cannot rate yourself and give yourself five stars for a shitty goal. <laughs> um, okay. But you can certainly um, rate other highlights. Let me see if there is one in there. Drummy, yeah. <laughs> it's funny, isn't it? Uh, 
there is a testing highlight that Starwind's putting here, dummy. Okay, you can click on it, you can watch it. What you see, uh -huh. uh, the uploader has selected all four scenes, wants me to watch everything. And here's also the version, aha, uh -huh. this highlight has been recorded with Amiga Swass on 50 frames per second. In case you play the DOS version, and you save a highlight and you share it, this button will tell it was the DOS version recorded with that many frames. Okay, and then you can go on and watch it. Probably just some random <laughs> DOS version blasphemy. Well, some people like it. Yeah, and remember your replay controls. If you can, you can speed this up, you can slow it down, and even go like frame by frame with the keyboard. Go back, speed up, Amiga forever. That's right. Okay, and then you watch the highlight and you feel like, mm, okay, pretty cool or pretty shitty. And depending on how you how you would rate the highlight, um, after you watched it, you just go here where it says rate and click, and you can toggle through your rating. So obviously, five stars, five point zero is the best rating. You can give to a highlight. Should be a pretty amazing one then. Or if you say, I don't want to rate it anymore, you click another time and your rating is off. And let's say this was pretty, pretty boring. One star. Okay. I give it one star. Same. Your uh, ratings are uploaded to the server or updated on the server as soon as you exit this menu. And it, of course, would go into the monthly chart. So it's sorted by month. Yeah. And then on the top spot, rank number one would be the goal that has the most, or the, the best ratings. This was recorded with Amiga, 60 frames per second, scene number seven of eight. You can always look at them. Aha, uh -huh. had a header combination, right? Nice goal. Long shot. Pretty nice goal. Zack. Any questions to Swas Galore? And here you can scroll through the months. April, there's nothing yet. Obviously, it's not April. February. Oh, yeah. We will always have a goal of the month now. Automatically, by how people rate highlights. Democracy for life. <laughs> and then there's an all-time chart, which selects goals by how they have been rated from any month. So this one here is the highest rating by now, 4.5. What you cannot see yet, which might be an addition, is how many people have rated. How many, how many people in total have rated? I think we could squeeze this information somewhere. Somewhere down here. Yeah, let's see. I mean, I hope I hope uh, many people will use it and share their highlights. Oh, that would be great. Oh so yeah, this is this is how Swascolor works. Upload your highlights, rate highlights, share it. Uh, this is also a nice menu to record videos or make a video compilation of highlights with uh, nowadays software that's a child's play to do. Oh yeah, and if you're like uncertain, hey, what are the replay controls again? Here's this menu, and it tells you everything about the replays. This is awesome work by Starvins. 
Any questions to Swas Galore? Hmm. Oh, and if you have tuned in late, you can go back if you like the DOS version better. <laughs> um, Higgy, Higgy likes the Amiga version better, as we know. Uh, you can press the F5 button and you can go back to the DOS menu layout. In the career mode, it would look like this. DOS, Amiga, DOS, Amiga, what menu, DOS colors, Amiga colors. Okay. Um, I still have Xbox Live a card gameplay. I might restart the game with Amiga. 60 frames per second. There we go. Uh, was there anything else on the menu that I needed to show you guys? Let me just see that I haven't forgotten anything. No, we got we got the menu, we got Swascolore, we got 60 frames per second gameplay. Xbox Live Card gameplay. Everything seems to be seems to be presented. Let me know if you wanna see anything again or uh in the meantime I just play another match of career mode. Um Inter. Uh, I kind of want to get rid of Jürgen Klinsmann. I don't like him so much. Uh, thank you, Paul. But now I'm going to need him because... I see. Lordis Conte. Let's see how that guy is doing. Yeah, so Amiga DOS. What do you guys like better from the menu layout? The DOS colors, like this, or Amiga, like that? Yeah, Rui Costa, I have issues with Klinsmann, I don't like him. <laughs> Amiga for sure. Yeah, for me too. It's kind of... looks more like home. I mean, I mean <laughs> totally fine. <laughs> Alright, let's play. <clears throat> Would you believe that I have issues with Rui Costa nowadays? You do? What kind of issues do you have with Rui Costa? What a hit! Hey, Eticos, how's it going? Where's your old Twitch account? Finding space down the middle. Good challenge. And that's a good header. Keeper's done really well, mind you. They've won another corner. Oh, 4 0. Uh, let's say it will be available in 15 minutes. How about that? Well, that's a nice little one, too. And he goes yes. On, 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 on. George Rea. Man, the ball just stuck to his feet in the shots. Yeah. Well, the ball skills are very tidy. George Weir is the impersonated the gold scoring away. superstar hero. That's right. <laughs> Neat ball through the middle. It's good flying save from the goalkeeper. <laughs>
Oh, oh. They've got the ball. Finding space down the middle. The referee says Ouch. No there'll be a throw in. He has ignored crimes from the previous president that stole the club. Ooh. He did? Well, but there's too much money involved. People try to try to be oh, a little bogus. It's a very, very good challenge. Had to be. It's another corner. They really need to make use of this. Finds the net. Classic Amiga goal. Works on 60 frames per second as well. It's a good passing move. Oh, fantastic by the keeper. It's on his head. Gets his head to it. The cross ending up in the keeper's hand. The goalkeeper up to the task. Mm. Crowd really cheering them on. The through ball sets up the attack. Again, a throw in. And that's a good header. Gets his head to oh. it. Almost. Almost. What is Rui Costa uh, up to now? And which club is it? Oh, with classic header? Uh, well, it's actually not that hard. When you have a corner, maybe I get another corner so I can like... Kind of show you how to do that. Pull that off. Good save. Oh, he is president of Benfica. Wow. Looking for some open space. Oh, an amazing save by the keeper. The commentary is better than FIFA. That's right. Head to it, and a strong header. The cross ending up in the keeper's hands. Headed on. A thumping finish. Emphatic. Emphatic. Well maintained there. Great ball into space. Good work to retain it. And he dinks it through. Uh oh. And the goalkeeper Ooh. blocked out the light. The gameplay. <laughs> it's on his head. Well won in the air. Funny tackle there. Headed on. The keeper's done very well to get to that. I can't get another corner. Uh. It's a good passing move. They've got the ball. Trying to orchestrate something. Oh, excellent. No corner. And the header. It's on his head. Accurate passing between the two of them. Oh, he made himself I safe. And, to block it. No and the paid DLCs. <laughs> <laughs> Good header. It's on his head. Neat ball through the middle. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. Wins the ball. He's gone down. Oh, and penalty. And inside the box. Okay. And it's been saved. There we go. Now I got a corner. Good chance here. So, uh, Chikio. When you get a corner, the guy runs up to, the, to take the corner kick. You let loose. You do not press any direction. You just hold down fire. So he makes a straight like middle high middle high cross yeah? and as soon as it reaches that blonde guy over there which is Klinsmann in my uh, in my case and the ball is like somewhere over his head you press fire and then after you press fire you press in this case bottom left because you want the ball to go diagonal bottom left Okay, so fire without any direction, fire again without any direction, and then bottom left. That's the theory. Let's see how that works. And doesn't work. <laughs> Maybe I waited too long. If you pause the game, it acts weird. But yeah, this is this is how it usually works. An 
exhilarating performance for <laughs> today. Their manager will be more. There you go. And yeah, it makes such a difference from DOS to Amiga. Amiga is just looks better, feels better, plays better. Okay, cup against Parma. Will I get rid of Klinsmann? Honor practice mode in the future. That's it. Yeah. Um. You cannot do that with a pad. I think it's. Well, when you say you can't do it, do you mean like you're just not used to it, the corner goal? Oh, I see. Uh, hey, I want to put a part exchange offer here for Klinsmann. I just want to get rid of him. Do you know any good striker from 1990 that you want me to buy? Litbarski? Litbarski to Inter. Yeah, he's a right wing. I need an attacker. I was thinking about Romario from PSV, but he is a little pricey. Maradona from Maradona. I think in 1990 he might be one of the most expensive players there. Napoli. Yeah, 15 million. Ooh, Jean Pierre Papin. Papin in 19. Carica, that's a good one too. I love Carica. Papin played for Marseille in 1990, I guess. Yeah, he guess this is the 1990-91 database. Yeah, Papa. Oh, he's six million. Ooh, Eric Cantona. Hmm. Who else is there? Come on, keep the names coming. They are all a little pricey. I would like to get somebody like for four million. Actually, I might try. Um, I might try to get Romar. Just because Romario is a baller. Okay, off a of Klinsmann. Let's see if they want to do that. How about that for an offer? A little more. Obviously, they're not willing to. I'm not. Su I'm not surprised. <laughs> Are there any good Where's Alan Shearer in 1990? He played for Blackburn? In Southampton? Yes, not Blackburn. Southampton. There we go. Two points. Okay, Alan Shearer. And they can have. Odd exchange deal. You can have that guy. Oh, too slow? Well, it's Alan Shearer. I don't really much care about speed then, if I have Alan Shearer. <laughs> who else? Who else could I buy? Before I make an offer. Some more names in here. Striker. 1990. Which club did Roger Miller? Ian Rush? He's probably there. Liverpool. Yep. There he is. Oleg Salenko? Which club did he play for? In Russia bargain. Oh, Tony Yeboa. Yes. Uh, but he played, I guess he already played in Germany for Saarbrücken. Uh, no. Akpobori. Did any call Stoichkov? Man. Now you're getting good ideas, but Stoichkov is probably like already. Yeah, he's already at 6 million in Barcelona. Laudrup. 
Let me check out Dynamo Kiev. Uh, wait, in 1990 there was no Kiev. That was... I didn't play... England. Ian Wright. Wait, Newcastle is... Where is Newcastle? They are not even in the Premier League in 1990. Nah. Who played for Ajax? Ooh, Dennis Bergkamp. But already 6 million. A little too pricey. Who's playing in Real Madrid at that time? Hugo Sanchez, the Mexican guy. I saw his house in Cancun. When I was in Cancun in Mexico, I saw his house. Crazy. Crazy home. Okay, let's check out Arsenal. Oops. The DDR, the East German clubs. Arsenal. There's no Ian Wright. Which club is Ian Wright playing for in 1990? Palace, okay. Oh, here. Mm -hmm. At 3 million, not, not too bad. Come on. Should I wait until I get another? I'm gonna try for Shira, and if I don't get Shira, I'm gonna wait until I get cash for Klinsman. So I don't have to do a part exchange deal. Yeah, at Monaco. Gary Lineker, yes. Gary Lineker. Gary Lineker, what's Gary Lineker playing for in 1990? Tottenham? Yes, he does. With Gather, with uh, together with Paul Gascoigne. Okay, let me have a go on Shira. The young Alan Shira. So I wanted to give away that guy and put down my price. They don't want to do that. Maybe just for cash, or a little more cash. Ah. This is this was twenty two oh Rockinson one. This is um Swas twenty twenty with the database DLC from nineteen ninety ninety one. But the whole game is based on the ninety six ninety seven version. Best player in money. Oh my god. <laughs> Let me try that. Okay, let, let me let me load that career. Uh, Rockinson won. What is, what is strange? Oh. What's strange? A Rui Costa, but then I could like maybe go for a strange gameplay. Well, it's the same. It's the same gameplay as was ninety six ninety seven. That's the gameplay. Um, Rui Costa, how did this trick work again? How did this work again? But if I do that, I want to try Bebeto because I, I love Bebeto. Vasco da Gama, let me see. Okay, so Bebeto, and then I offer. It has to be the same position, so I offer them a striker. Oh, wait. It has to be the same position, damn it. Maybe I wait until, until this guy is money. Okay, I'm gonna play another game. I just... If it has to be the same position, then I'm trying to get this guy be worth like whatever 50k 
and then I'm gonna try the the good old cheat. Oh yeah, Van Basten is at AC Milan, obviously, together with Gullit and Reichardt. Yeah, I think he's at 50 million. Oh, the penalty going over the bar? Um, well, if you blast it over the bar, sure, it goes over. Gets his head to it. It's another corner. They really need to make use of this. Oh. And they still have it. It went out of play. There's a Barisi brother in each club. That's right. They're trying to orchestrate something. Well, the ball skills of and that is quite glorious. Oh, after save. Mm, it could happen in the DOS version. Depending on how much swerve you add to the ball. No need for that. He hey, that's not a penalty. That was before. I think you ruined the classic corner. Yeah. Oh, okay. I guess it's inside the box. <laughs> I thought he did really well to hold um, his and score that penalty. Savicevic from Milan. The post in the way. Headed on. Well, that's a nice little one too. A thumping finish. Emphatic. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Awesome. Avicovic, great player. Good header. Oh! It's a good passing move. Whistle goes. Referee. The whistle goes. It's a very good block tackle. Keeper, what are you doing? Oh. Jesus! Look at that. I think it was a miscued back pass. Yeah, oh, look at the goalkeeper. Duh. Whoa. I'm going to record this and upload it to Swaz Galore. And the ball's out of play. And what a finish! Yes. Another good pass. Ooh, the young Boxage and Shuker. That's also a good call. And an instinctive reaction save. Yeah, the Monkey Island ad board. Yeah, yeah, it's awesome, isn't it? The post to the rescue. There's some more Amiga games in there. Worms. Oopsie. No. He saw it coming and just picked it out of the air. Exchange of passes, finding their men well. An expert keeper bug? No, no. It depends on if you miscue a back pass to your own keeper and then swerve it outside of the goal. That's what happens. It's on his head. There you go, Roberto Mancini. Mm-hmm. Alvatore Skil I could get I should get Skilachki because he moved to Inter like a season later. That's a great idea, and I love Salvatore Skilachki. Well one in the air. Tries to slice open the defense. Gets his head to it. No whistle. Ouch. A shock. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the head. He has hit the post. Linsman, you can't score in an open goal. You have to go. And he curled it in. Toto Skilachki. Oh, Marco Simonen. I don't know. I don't like Marco Simonen. With his head. Surely that was a foul. And he uh oh. The computer team is gearing up. Great ball into space. 
Oh, good save. Trouble. Where is Ruben Sosa playing at that year? The post in the way. They're trying to orchestrate something. It's all smiled now, including a four -four. Smile from the Nice game. The man with the white boots. Oh, yeah. Challenge. In the Bundesliga, Giovanni Elba was the first one with uh, the white boots. Strong in the air. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. Another throw in here. Change of passes, finding their men well. Oh, yeah, 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 Klinsmann. Klinsmann, you have to go. You need too many chances. Straight through the defense. Goalkeeper's ball, surely. Very commanding in the air. That's a cleanly one header. The goalkeeper up to the task. Crowd really cheering them on. This is my last chance to win this. Great ball through. That's it. Yep. Oh! <laughs> Fucking modern football. That's right. <laughs> hey, I played my whole career with Copa Mundial from Adidas. Well, career. <laughs> when I was playing at to do soccer. This is Windows, yeah. So this is Swans 2020 for Windows. Okay, um, I'm gonna save, upload the update. Actually, wait. Mm, replays first. I wanted to save that highlight file. Highlight, save highlight. That was a keeper. Strange keeper. Okay. Lore, login. Share highlights. Uh. With an S. There you go. That's it. Let me just. Uh oh. Bug found. Anyway, um, I let it save. Let me see if that happens again. Bug found live on stream. I like that. Post galore. Log in. Okay. Share highlights. Let's see if I try to watch the highlight from here. Yep. Okay, there we go. Bug found. Bug noted. Try that again. Uh. See if I can watch the highlight from here. Oh, I can't. Ah, I think because there are more than 10 and it's 10 seconds. Anyways, never mind. So, I'm gonna upload the game so you can have a go at it. And then I'm gonna buy some players and you can try to score goals and upload it and report back so I can see your goals and highlights. Let me just upload the files to the server and you can go ahead and download the latest version. Again. It's uploading. Yep. Launcher is uploading. And also, I have to update. The homepage, Media Fire. Okay, so you guys can go ahead. 
when you restart your launcher, this is what you should see. Check for new versions. There you go. New version found 4.0. Robbie Baggio. Can you play PC version online, player versus player? Oh, um, no, not this one, but of course you can play online with the classic Amiga version emulator that we've been playing online with for years. So this does not have an online mode yet, but it's going to come at one point for sure. Okay, so you can go ahead, upload, um, restart your launcher, and you will see 4.0. And this is going to go to 4.02. Oh, there you go. Now oh, everything is on 4.0. And I'm also going to update the website, the main download website. Those installer. Here's the 4.0 here. I can show you this live, I guess. Home so homepage. You go to our homepage, sensiblesaga.de, to SWAS 2020. Let me just edit this real quick. If you have not installed the game yet and you need the full installer, you go here. It's going to get a new. Okay, this is 4.0. It will have Amiga and DOS menus, speedrun mode, SWAS galore. Rate and share highlights. And what else is there? Amiga 60 frames per second and Xbox Live or Cut game. Gameplay. Original gameplay. Save. There we go. Some nice add-ons in there. And the link for 4.0 is updated. So go ahead, try play. And you can come back to the chat if you have like a nice highlight file or a nice goal that you want me to rate or show to the viewers. In the meantime, I keep playing and uh, I hope I can find a sub for Cleansman because he's, he's like really bugging me. <laughs> There we go. Fiorentina, that's Bacho, yeah. Oh, Vlaovic, yeah, he came from Florentina too. AC Milan. So oh, there you go. Van Basten is on 12 million, not 15. Fill it on 8 or I cut on 8. That Milan team was quite some team. <laughs> Bargain. Skilachki. I don't have enough cash for Skilachki. Masaro, yeah, but Masaro is like... Hmm. Kind of doesn't have that edge to his name. Oh. Let's play again. I think the crash just. Um, I, I checked out Darko Panchev, but he played 
in Germany after after he played for Inter in '94 for Leipzig, and people didn't really like him. Keeper's done really well, mind you. That is what he's paid for. It's on his head. Well, one in the air. Good. Great. Oh. And he dinks it through. Mm. That would have been a nice goal. Holland. <laughs> he's he's injured too often. Holland. Hey, uh, Rockinson One, I don't know why you're holding back. You can you can play online Amiga Swas on your PC. You don't you don't need this version to get online play. There's a superb online play with the Amiga version. Let me just pause this. So, um, Rockinson One, here you go ahead and check out. This. Go to this link, download this version, and then just join join the online leagues. They run they run every month. This is the current like league table of the Amiga Super League. You see, you can start in the lowest league and try to compete here. People are constantly playing. Join the Discord chat to find players. You can play Swas Online every day. With the Amiga version and an emu through an emulator, and it has even peer-to-peer -peer network play, so it's pretty, it's pretty good. It plays great. And then in the meantime, we can develop this Windows release further. Got the all-important touch. Good through ball up the middle. Good flying save from the goalkeeper. That's a good ball. Headed clear. It's on his head. Good challenge. With his head. Well, the ball skills are all oh, fantastic well. by the keeper. Uh oh. Ooh. Punched away. Good save. Well read. Oh, an amazing save by the keeper. Well won in the air. Safe goalkeeping. Just command his air. No, no. Oh, you want to play the PC DOS version online? Is that what you say? Oh, I see. Okay, okay. Technically, you can do that too with a special version that uses. DOS box. There is an online mode for it, but nobody's playing it. So what you're asking for is technically working already Slick with DOS box and, pace two. and a special Swas Plus Plus version. And he done it. Um, yeah, but nobody, you won't find any opponents because everybody's playing the Amiga version. <laughs> Sets up the attack. Good oh. um, one opponent you have? Who's that? I would love to play with you, but um, the ping is pretty shitty from California to Europe. <laughs> oh, good save. Gets his head to it. Strong in the air.
and a strong header. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. And he's hit the jackpot. That's a good guy there, my reserve player. He's not bad. Looking for some open space. They cross ending up in the keeper's hands. Who's your opponent? Good work. Your friend? He's punched it away. Oh, that's cool. And a strong header. Gets his head to it. It's on it. Neatly oh. pushed away. Slick passing. If you have interest, uh, you can join the Swiss World Cup in summer in Barcelona. And that's a very fine header. Fine save. Ooh. Yeah. And the header. They're trying to orchestrate something. Headed on. Keeper's there. He made the right move and picks it up. Good save. Good save. And a strong head. No whistle. Yeah, no whistle, but injured guy. Good teamwork there. Referee, get your whistle out. Pushed away. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. Oh, nice work to keep possession. Armour was a hard nut to crack, huh? And that's the end of tonight's broadcast from me, John Champion. And my co-commentator Jim Beglin. Jim Beglin. A very good evening. Oh, that was just the first leg. Okay. He started on PC DOS. He never played Amiga version. Mm. He should give it a try. Bam, bam. Dola in Napoli? Yes, he's on the bench, I believe. There we go. Mm -hmm. Yep. Dola's on the bench. Uh huh. Man, they had players there. It's crazy. Thomas Brolin, I just played against him. There's Tavarel or Pama. <laughs> Sampdoria here's Mancini and Viali by the way this is the this is the season 1991 where Sampdoria Genoa were champions and then the year after they reached the European Cup final against Barcelona and lost with a goal by Koeman Mm hmm Yes. Lazio, Karl-Heinz Riedler, Ruben Sosa. Not bad. Mm hmm Fiorentina, Marius Lakatos, Diego Fuser. Carlos, du Carlos Dunga. Awesome. Um, Red Star Belgrade. Here's Darko. Here's Darko Panchev. Roma had Rudy Vella. And here's Savicevic. So oh, that's the team that won the European Cup 90, 1991. Where's Matt Letizia in that season? Southampton? Yep.
Yeah, so Rokinson, please try the Amiga version online with your friend. He might like happen to like it, really. I want a deal for Cleansman, really. Amiga Live with a resub. Hey, thank you, John. How's it going? John, you love Amiga so much. So look at those nice, nice Amiga uh, menus. And with F6, we can go to save that game. Yes, abort. Don't want to save now. I just want to play. Thank you for the follow, Rokinson1. Appreciate it. So, John, yeah, you just tuned in. Uh, this is Amiga Swass gameplay with 60 frames per second. Like, running super smooth. Finds the net! A spectacular effort! And that's a very fine header. Intercepted well. Good header. Oops. <laughs> Padovano in Pisa, Legend of Juventus. That's right. Pace two. Ouch. Headed on. Oh, hmm, nice save. It's another good pass. Ouch. That's a penalty. Slick passing. And punched away. It's another corner. They really need to make use. And he curled it in. Oh, Proker, there we go. You see? <laughs> I'm too old to remember that, players. <laughs> and he's done it. How can you ever forget them? Teamwork there. Finds his man in space. Good through ball up the middle. Ouch. Ouch. Here? Yeah. I mean it's like a it's a muddy pitch, so it might be a little a little off. And he dinks But yeah, through. this is perfectly Amiga gameplay. It just doesn't bounce too much because it's muddy. Great ball into space. Safe goalkeeping. He does command his How about Ivan Zamorano? Hmm, not bad. Headed on. Where's he playing for in in that year? In the post. Slick passing. Oh, fantastic block. Ooh, that was close. Sevilla. Hmm. Bam Bam Zamorano. <laughs> Headed clear. Oh, in the air? Hmm. Get plucked out of the air by the goalkeeper. And a header! <laughs> That's a good ball. Goes to ground, but the referee says play on. Well, I must say it looked a foul when I first saw it, but the ref says no. The ref says no, no foul. And that's a good header. It's oh, excellent. Ouch. Slick passing. And pace keeper blocks it. Great block. And the header. That little passage of play was beautiful. And he makes it. Samurano started uh, 
in St. Gallen in Switzerland? Interesting, I didn't know that. Headed on. I don't think the keeper hmm. would have gone to that. And that's a good header. The keeper comes and collects it. Great ball through. Oh, calm as you like. He <laughs> nailed it. <laughs> With his head and the header straight through the defense and that's a good header the post to the rescue. okay john you tune in late let me show you the nice additions to the main menu or to the menu and uh, so any kind of menu Amiga Tized. Oh, you see that? Amiga. DOS. Amiga. DOS. You can just switch with F5. The old DOS menu. Or Amiga, if you like. And if you press F6, it throws you directly into the save menu. And that's the new... Clear out, click main menu with Amiga colors or with DOS colors. Yeah, it switches in real time on F5. You just hit F5 and you switch back and forth. I still got no offer for Klinsmann. It's depressing. Um, by the way, did anybody Um Let's see. <laughs> if anybody has already uploaded the highlight file. No, no not yet. So, but if you want to try out this version, you can go ahead and update it through your launcher. It's it's ready to play. Ellie McCoist. <laughs> yeah, it does feel more natural, right? It's beautiful. But hey, let's uh, let's have a look at Scotland there. Why not? Celtic. All next day. Pat Bonner. Pat Bonner is kind of a goalkeeping legend in Scotland, I suppose. Horace, nice. Are you tried yours super smoothly? Nice. Awesome. Rangers. There's Ellie McCoist. <laughs> Who's playing for Feyenoord in that year? Just thought about uh, Gaston Talment. Talment? Don't even know how to pronounce his name. Here you go. Nick Nilis. John the Wolf. John the Wolf. At the Hui. The Hui. Yeah, Torment. So you said Samurano played at Sevilla, huh? Oh, yes, he does. Samorano. Oh, I can get Samorano. Should I throw in another player? Maybe that guy. Ah. <laughs> um. I have too many defenders. Mandolini or Pagan? Pagan? I give up on that guy. Maybe I can save a little bit of cash. Yes, there we go. I got Ivan Zamorano for 2 million. What do you know? Yes, Zamorano had a 35 
full season at Real Madrid. That's that's true. Ivan Zamorano. Linsman doesn't like it. But Klinsmann is out. I want to see this guy getting a value. He, he doesn't even get a big X. He's been subbed in. Um, congrats, remember his signature celebration? <laughs> yeah. And you remember his shirt number. When Ronaldo came to Inter, he had like 1 plus 8. Because Ronaldo took his number 9 in the second year. Oh, by the way, by the way, Ronaldo. Let me just get something. So check this out. Um, sometimes I browse eBay for old Inter Milan shirts, and in the US there was a guy selling this. A new Inter shirt, and you spot the season. Can you spot the season from the shirt? Nope, it's 97 and it's his first year. Yes, 97, 98. An original Inter jersey, Umbro, with the Ronaldo um, name and number, number 10 in his first year, he had number 10 before he got the number 9 on it. And I got that for 28 bucks in awesome condition and it fits, it fits great. if I can put this up here. <laughs> Super nice. Um, Rock and Zone, yeah, you joined, you joined Lubin in 2015? Then we have met. I've been in Lubin. That's awesome. Let me see. Uh, maybe we can find the. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I, I, I memory is coming back. Sorry about that, man. Um, where's the Lubin tournament? Tournaments, events, World Cup. Oh, you have the Romario number eleven from. I do have the Brazil shirt from ninety four two Rui Costa, but no name, no name on it. So the Umbro shirt. I smashed you. Oops, sorry. I hope I wasn't rude. Did we play PC or Amiga? Oh, Marcin 20? Okay, so it was not on PC. Amiga? Hmm. Marcin 20. There you go. Oh, did we play in a knockout match? You could still use that, that login in SWAS 2020. Here you are, Marcin 20. Hey, you played quite a good group stage there. Not bad. Mm hmm Joker, you played against Joker? Yeah. Yep, Joker and Dennis. So that was 94. <laughs> awesome. Let's see what Samurano can do, huh? Mm 
<laughs> yeah, that's right. A great player with a hat. Like, he could jump like Michael Jordan. He wasn't that tall, but incredible like. And the goalkeeper blocked out the light. And a header! The goalkeeper up to the Ooh. task. Crowd really cheering them on. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. Worth a try. Oh, what a try! Ivan Zamorano. <laughs> Tries to slice open the defense. Hit the post. And a strong header. Unlucky goalkeeper. Here he is again. Really well taken goal. Mm hmm That's true. He's on great Ooh. form today and he's willing to try anything. That was a brilliant strike. And that's a very fine header. Plays it through. Took him out completely. Ouch. Gave away a free kick. Hmm. That's a wonderful save. Looking for that incisive through ball. Wins it. Will he have a go? Amarano with a head? They really need to make use of this. Nope, not with his head. That's a cleanly one header. And easy really for the goalkeeper. Comfortable save. Klinsmann is on the bench crying. Yeah, that's right. That's where he belongs. What a rocket! That wasn't a rocket. <laughs> a good ball good header oh somebody just blocked Samorano's header head. suckers so skills are very tidy and the header yeah. good, good challenge come on Ivan run was an okay half time Oh, by the way, if you haven't, like, seen this since was now, as new FIFA rules, rules have been applied, you can do a kickoff backwards into your own half. Well, the goalkeeper's got underneath that one and the strikers couldn't get to it. Strong in the air. He's free. Oh. Had an instinctive reaction save. Well, one in the air. Keeper's done really well, mind you. That is what he's paid for. Well, that's a nice little one, too. And he's done it! Tries and reserves with real players that would progress. Roberto Carlos Totti. Mm -hmm. and he does what Ouch. He does best. <laughs> yeah. Held by the keeper. Neat ball through the middle. Tries to slice open the defense. The keeper comes in and makes the catch. He's caught it beautifully. Ivan. Ivan Zimzam Zamorano. But play stopped nonetheless by the referee. And that's a very fine header. Read the play so well and got to the ball. Great work. That'll be a throw in. Piggy, do you see the headboard's wings? <laughs> and over here, you see Prince of Persia right next to me. Headed clear. And a strong header. They're trying to orchestrate something. And here we have flashback, another world, Zool, slam tilt, and metal slug. Great ball into space. 
By the way, Higgy, uh, how did you know about the stream? Did you get the newsletter? Neat ball through the middle. Intercepted well. And that is quite wow, that guy has some finishing. Oh, no. Okay, cool. Great ball through. He went down, but no whistle. Came up on your mobile, cool. Six one for Inter. I let's hope that somebody is offering money for Klinsmann. Okay. I bet. Mega guess. I guess maybe one or two more matches. Then this Roberto. Uh, Kalisti guy will get a value. He's already nine goals. He's probably finishing seven, like a rocket inside the box. How much value do you think he will get when he turns from a reserve player into a squad player? Well, I think he's gonna shoot up to 200k straight. 4.5 million? Okay. I don't think, no, I don't think so. 65k, I think 200k. Let him play. See what happens. Found a nice talent there. His control is not superb, speed, mm, but his finishing is godlike. Another good pass. Go easy, really, for the goalkeeper. Comfortable save. That'll be a throw in. Milan will come in for Klinsmann. Yeah, and then, then you know what happens. Milan buys Klinsmann, and then uh, Van Basten disappears from the game forever. And the ball comes down <laughs> the gloves of the keeper. I don't want that. <laughs> That's a cleanly won header. And the header. Good save. Boston is about to get injured. Oh man, that's yeah. Okay, well, it's another two years down the road. Help, safe goalkeeping. Just command his area. He'll shoot. There he is. Kalisti. Kalisti. Oh, however you pronounce the C in the beginning. Good through ball up the middle. They cross, ending up in the keeper's hands. <laughs> yeah, the um, the right backs, if they have like a CST or something, they. Headed on. The keeper saw it coming. Samurano, nice heading. The they can start. Like Game of Thrones. It's all smiles now, including a wry smile from the manager. I'm surprised his face hasn't cracked. Andrea Pipo, goal, golazo. He makes the stop. Accurate passing between the two of them. Ah. Uh. Looking for some open space. A rope up call. He's caught it beautifully. <laughs> Animated nets. Yep. Good call. But the next step is, is uh, HD graphics. And then after that, animations. Sensible massacre version. <laughs> Looking for that incisive through ball. Another throw in here. It's on his head. Slick passing. And pace two. Well, their ball skills are very tidy. 
Here we go, Samovano. And that's a good header. It's on his head. Headed clear. Strong in the air. That'll be a throw in. Good header. Oh. Finding space down the middle. It's a good passing move. Oh, too many players there. Out. Rockinson, uh, thanks for stopping by. Yeah, try some online swas. And yes, swas forever. Strong in the air. Well, one in the air. Well, I fully expected him to score. Ooh, Higgy. See you, buddy. Thanks for stopping by and nice to talk to you again. In a while, huh? See you. He's punched it away. Finding space down the middle. That's well, that was so oh. lucky. That shot was on target and the post saved him. That would have been a nice one. Yeah, yeah. Um, so, Stavins, I think the crash with the highlight file was a 10 second one. 10 second highlights, and there were more than 10, 10 scenes in it. Or 10 scenes. And then it happened. I can send you the file. Thanks. Thanks for stopping in. I saw your message on Discord too. And guys, please give one applause here for Starvins. Uh, he did all the coding. So whatever whatever is going on in here, Starvins is making it happen. Starvins, you're awesome. Thank you so much. Starvins is the best. The guy is still on reserve. The longer it takes, the higher his value is going to be, I think. Come on. Another game. Lazio against Inter. Ruben Sosa, Riedler. Actually, I could start with even a the value rising tactic to do that might amp up even more. Here we go. Let's do this, and when the game starts, I can switch back to my own. Oh yeah, um, Rui Costa. Yes, we can. We can change that. We could. We could, but the problem is in. If you do a two point, two points for a win, the old tables they had like, when they would lose a match, they had zero to two points. You know they had these negative points too, so I don't know if it makes much sense to do that. Oh, Proker, uh, don't be fooled. My sweeper is actually moving forward in defense midfield. So he's, he doesn't play defender central. It's just the way I set up my tactic. Safely into the keeper's gloves. Well, it was only a matter of time before okay. So now he might be in the back as soon as the play goes on. You will see him right behind Mateus in in is the is, you see? There's Aaron Winter, He's right in, in midfield where he belongs. He made himself big and managed to block it. Plays it through. And the header. I wish Mateus would be a little faster. I think he's too slow for how fast he really was in that time. 
Yep, Aaron Winter, great player. Trying to orchestrate something. Well, one in the air. Well, that's a nice little one too. A thumping finish. Alisti. Ah, oh, the ref's not going to be swayed by that. That's a cleanly won header. Headed clear. Gets his head to it. Oops. Yeah, Serie A, man. The players that they had. Incredible. Incredible. Great ball through. Strong. Oh, fantastic block. Oh, an amazing save by the keeper. Mm. That's a cleanly one header. And he does what he does best. Come on, Arnold. It's a rugged but fair tackle. Oh, good save. And a header. Headed clear. Yeah. Yes. Now that's something to share. Um, I can help you with that in a moment. Let me finish this match and then we can check out some links. Looking for some open space. Well held. Good touch of the ball for the goalkeeper. What type of uh, plastic do you have? Well, 15 pin PC and. Oh, penalty given, yep. Oh. Oh, Matthäus comes to the rescue. Oh, Samuano. They're trying to orchestrate something. And the header, headed on, and that's a good header. They're going to throw in a good area, looking for some support now. He keeps his eye on the ball to win the header. Oh. That's a throw. Strong in the air, good save. Cartman, 1974, welcome to the stream, and greetings to Italy. Bella Italia. Plays it through. I'm just playing in Italy right here. Saved by the keeper. It's Inter against Lazio. Saved by a goalkeeper <laughs> who is an excellent shot stopper. Exchange of passes, finding their men well. And the goalkeeper blocked the light. And a header! And a strong header! Safe. Headed on. They're trying to orchestrate something. Da, 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 da. Good flying save oh. from the goalkeeper. Nice save. Red the finish of an opportunist. Samorano. Ivan Samorano. Okay, Rui Costa, let's see if this guy got a value now. And then we check out your joystick adapter. Creating the opportunities and then making sure you put them away. And my, they've done that here and secured all three points. Yep, they secured all three points. UEFA Cup second round. Karlsruhe. Mönchengladbach Gladbach, 0 0, Newcastle. Huh. I got a transfer offer. And he's still in reserve. Okay. Wow. He's gonna get probably more than 200k. 
Dave, let's see. Transfer offer, please, for Cleansman. Oh. It's not for Cleansman. Paganin and Val Algioglio. They want my. They offer this guy and cash to squad. They are both on the bench. <laughs> Ooh! Can I ask for more? Okay. They withdraw their offer. I should have taken the 1.1 million, huh? Happens when you're too greedy. Okay, Rui Costa, you are adopters. Let's see. Yeah, I could get like a low, uh, like a reserve goalkeeper for 100k. That's not a problem. I should have taken the offer. Okay, uh, adopters. So I have collected a few links here. Let me see. So what you need is. Game port, there we go, to USB. Yeah, you basically need one of these suckers. Yeah, I was too greedy. <laughs> Here, um, that will do. Game port, USB, adapter. Let's see if there's another one that might work even better. Don't get this one, this is not a real game port thing. That's that's a good one. The Radio Shack is probably even better. <laughs> yeah. So I would suggest get the Radio Shack one. They are they are great. This is in Iowa and this is in Kansas. Well, okay, this is from the US. So you might have to do a eBay search will really cost us. Make an eBay search for US like uh, game port to USB. And if not, you can follow that link here and see. But they all they all work fine. The Radio Shack ones are a little older, but they worked better than the screen thing. I think it might be a little more responsive. Okay. Okay, here we are back. Um, has anybody recorded a highlight file yet and uploaded it? Yes, I see. There has been an upload. Was galore, let's see that. Chaos to Ice, Slow Lob. Okay, rate highlights. It's interesting. I think we have to do something with the date here. This date is wrong. Robbins, if you're still watching, you have to figure out why the date is wrong. Or maybe the goal has been recorded then. Probably. Oh yeah, ah yeah, yeah. So the date is probably right. It was on his on his hard drive and he shared it from that. So yeah, let's watch the goal. Ooh, nice shot. Look at that. I want to see that again. But I'm not sure if that was DOS. Yeah. Nice. Let's go back. Nice header, and then with the first touch, bam. Meow. Nice goal, Chaos 2 Ice. So, how much stars do we give do we give this goal? What do you say, Rui Costa? Or is fair? 
Let's see it again. The setup is nice with the header and then first touch. Nice timing right in the corner. Oh. I'll give I'll give that a four star. Nice. Uh, I think we can get rid of all these highlights. The only problem that we have, uh, Starvins, if you're still watching, since this highlight is from November 2021, we might uh, change the date of highlights to when they were uploaded. Yeah, that's probably better. Yeah. So this highlight has an old date because it's been scored in November of 2021. So we should just go with a date of upload. Let me make a note of that. Okay, that's noted. And then I keep on playing until this guy gets a value or Klinsman gets sold. Either one. I shouldn't play like that, huh? <laughs> this is too similar. Give them white pants. And an all white shirt. Otherwise you go swast blind. Ooh, look who who's playing for them. Kanichia and Ever. Not a bad attack. I could do I could do view result to check his value. Sure. Shall I do that? And then reload the game. Wait, I'm gonna save. I do view result and just, just to see his value. Not yet. Not yet. Oh, there we go. 300. 300k. So, my guess of 200k was quite okay. Okay. Load. Enter. Let's play. 300k. I've got like 10 more minutes of, of stream time, so come on, let's enjoy a little bit of Swas here. What a player, yeah. <laughs> Good header. Wait, who headed there? There was a header? It looked like it fell on my head while I was laying on the ground. <laughs> the manager wishes to change things round at this point. Headed on. That's a and that's a wonderful Ooh. save. Keeper blocks it. They're trying to orchestrate something. Oh, fantastic block. Well, the ball skills are very tidy. Goalkeeper so good with his distribution. Major buck. <laughs> Neat ball through the middle. Keeper's there. He made the right move and picks it up. 
headed on. Come on, get in there. Blocked out of the air by the keeper. The through ball sets up the attack. Well read and intercepted there. And he makes it. Yes, Samorano. Oh, nice, nice saves there. Good, tidied up well. Good teamwork there. Finds his great finish. Really confident. That's a classic Loda Mateus shot there. Accurate passing between the two of them. Hit the post. Headed on. It clear, good header. <laughs> header ping pong. They're looking for that incisive through ball. Alter Zenga, awesome goalkeeper. Europa Pokal. Went down, but no whistle. Looking for some open space. Hey. And well, the goalkeeper's got underneath that one, and the strikers couldn't get to it. <laughs> and that's a wonderful save. Ouch. And that's a very fine header. They're looking for that incisive through ball. Wins the ball back there very neatly, and gets the ball back. Hmm. Split the defense. Why? Oh, excellent. On. Wow, nice That's header, nice computer. What a hit! Amorano puts an end to that game. Wins it. Might have a go from here. Plays it through. Ooh. That's a cleanly won header. Well, they've really had the edge in terms of corners, but they just haven't made it count because the quality has been lacking so far. And they still have it. And that's a good, good header. Oh, close. Yeah. Thank you, Starvins. That's great. Spreading the play nicely. Thwarted by a fine save. And he dinks it through. Held by the keeper. Good header. Oh, where's the second striker? They're trying to orchestrate something. Or nothing. Nobody wants to buy Klinsmann, it's depressing. A win is a win is a win. And it's your win if you play Swaz 2020 or point zero. Still no offer for Klinsmann. All right, I think I'm at the end of my stream. Uh, it's been a ton of fun. Everything's working well. We had like one bug that we need to resolve. But I think it's a minor one with that long highlight file. Probably caused by the F6. Um, F6 glitch. Um, well, thank you guys for, for watching and I hope you enjoy version 4.0 with the new features. And please report any bugs that you find and... 
please note um the 60 frames per second amiga gameplay is probably not 100 percent amiga because it is not on an amiga so if you find anything that should be adjusted please give me a heads up all right let's see if there's anybody that we could that we could raid let's see who else is streaming today um We go on Twitch. Any raid suggestions? Virtual Dimension is Amiga Live, obviously. Amiga Live is always an option. Itch. Heinz and Amiga. I think we're gonna raid Amiga Live. No? Okay. Uh, I hope the next stream, I, I yeah, it's it's too long. I can't, I, I wanna stream more often, Rui Costa. And Horace, yeah, thank you. Um, you can use your new update right now. So just boot up SWAS, uh, the launcher, and then click update, and you're good to go. It's already there. And I think we can raid Amiga Live. Amiga Live, or my friend John in Canada, is an awesome platform where you can play Amiga games online. It's basically, it's a click and join version, and they stream, it streams like 24 hours. You can stream your own game there. Um, it's... It's pretty awesome. I love Amiga Live. Okay, guys, have a good night. Thank you for watching and hang in there and let's rate Amiga Live. Stay sensible and stay sensible on stream. Bye, guys.